mom challenged me to make a meal out of five random ingredients. First I chose sour cream, and then I chose dill, like the pickle, and then I chose garlic, but then it got interesting, I chose a wild card, so I went with flour, and lastly I chose hot sauce, so now I'm making a meal out of sriracha sauce, flour, sour cream, garlic, and pickles. I started by combining my flour and garlic in a bowl. Then I started dipping my pickles in the flour garlic mixture and I put it in the air fryer. Next I combined some sour cream and sriracha sauce. Woo! That is some good sriracha sour cream sauce. <laughs> and then when the pickle chips were ready, I dipped them in the sriracha sour cream sauce and I just had to do the Cassie dance. <laughs> These pickle chips tasted so good, I went back for seconds. <laughs> My mom challenged me to make a dish out of five random ingredients. First, I chose vinegar, and then I chose pomegranate, then I chose eggs, then I chose syrup, so I went with like a vanilla syrup, and lastly, I chose sugar. I've never worked with a pomegranate before, so this is gonna be interesting. First, I had to get the seeds out of the pomegranate, so I peeled the top off and then cut it into slices. And then I basically just beat the seeds out of it and put it in a food processor to get the juice out of it. I pulsed the food processor about three times and then I used a mesh strainer to separate the seeds from the liquid. In a small pot, I made pomegranate syrup and I set it aside to thicken. Then I used my piggy tool to separate three egg whites and I used a hand mixer until it was frothy. Then I added about two thirds cup of sugar and I also added some vanilla syrup and some vinegar. And then I dumped the bowl upside down to make sure it was ready. I spooned the mixture onto my lined baking sheet and I drizzled my pomegranate syrup on top. Then I put them in the oven and when I tasted them, they tasted so good, I had to dance. <laughs> my mom challenged me to make a meal out of five random ingredients. First, I chose eggs. And then I chose corn, so I went with a cornbread mix. And then I chose orange, so I picked a bunch of oranges. I chose almonds, and lastly, some honey. I literally have no idea how this is gonna turn out. But first I decided to make an orange glaze for my cornbread. I started by pouring a quarter cup of honey into a pot and juicing an orange into the pot as well. As that simmered on the stove, I zested an orange and set it aside. Then I poured a cup of almonds into a food processor and made almond flour, and then I added in my cornbread mix as well. So now I'm working with a corn almond flour. In a separate bowl, I combined half of a cup of honey and three eggs. Light and fluffy. I added in my homemade flours to the mixture and juiced some more oranges into it. Then I put my corn cake batter in the oven, and when it was cool enough, I flipped it over and poked some holes into it to pour my honey glaze over. This cake was so delicious, I had to do my happy dance. <laughs> my mom challenged me to make a meal out of five random ingredients. First, I chose peanut butter. Then I chose a chicken card, so I went with chicken breast. And then I got garlic. So, so far, this is a weird combination. <laughs> After that, I got lime. And then I chose a wild card and my mom made me choose green peppers. So now I'm making a meal out of chicken, garlic, green peppers, peanut butter, and lime. I started by cutting slits in my chicken and zesting my lime. Then I rubbed my lime zest into my chicken and I cooked it in a frying pan over medium heat. Then for my marinade, I added garlic, lime juice, and peanut butter and mixed it in with water to have a more saucy consistency. And then I had to chop up my green peppers. I actually wore masks during this process because they were pungent. Okay, now you gotta taste it. And then my mom challenged me to taste it and, well... What in the sour, spicy, sweet is that? <laughs> but I decided to still give the peanut butter sauce a chance, so I put it over my chicken and broiled it in the oven. And now it's time to try it. <laughs> Cassie, admit you failed. So yeah, it looks like this time my mom won the challenge. <laughs>